This is Southern California's first and only locally produced daily show for and about the Filipinos. Kung saan po ngayong hapon, kasama natin ang ating mga pinagmamalaking kababayan YouTube singing sensations, J.R. Aquino and Jen Soup. Jen is an adopted kababayan. Of course, she is Korean, but there is a Filipino connection there, and we're waiting for that connection still. I hope AJ Rafael makes it today on the show. He is stuck in traffic, coming from a meeting, but hopefully, hopefully. But before that, for those of you who are not familiar with the work of Jen, let's watch this. Making me giddy. <laughs> Is it making you giddy? Um, yeah, I was smiling. I was do you like, remember <laughs> the time when you recorded that? Yes, I do. I vividly remember it. It was actually the first time I I met AJ. And the very first, the very time. first time. So was there sparks flying already? Was, <laughs> it, was there an initial connection? Um, yeah, like we just we were we like clicked from the start. Like we, we hit were, it off and um, yeah. Yeah. Okay. We got along really well. I'll, I'll ask yeah. him later when he comes to me. <laughs> All right, let's make way for your phone calls. Our first caller is Sam. Magandang hapon sa you, Sam. Hi. Good afternoon. Um, good afternoon. I was just wondering, how has your experience been since YouTube? Have you been getting a lot of attention? You definitely are, right? Getting a lot of attention? Mm -hmm. yeah? Yeah, definitely. yeah? Yeah, definitely. Yeah. But does that make you improve or does that, are you taking formal lessons now because you know that more people are watching you? Is there more pressure when you choose your material? Do you ask, consult people, see what they want to hear from you? I, well, as far as for me, um, personally, whenever I do um, covers or whatnot, um, it's usually if I feel the song. Mm -hmm. If I like the song, then, you know, It'll show. It'll show when right. I perform it, right. and if and if they, they take it for what it is, mm -hmm. if they don't like it, then they don't like it. But it's something that I enjoy. Mm -hmm. So, um, as far as that, that's always been like my thing. Uh, so there's not really much pressure. Right. I love performing. Right. Um, so it's just like to you, it's just like playing, doing what yeah, you want to do. Yeah. But yes, YouTube's helped. Right, Jen. Um, I feel the same way. YouTube's helped a lot. Um, like after I got feedback, the good feedback mm -hmm. from the start, um, it just motivated me a lot mm -hmm. to do more covers on YouTube. Mm -hmm. And at first I was like, oh, I'll take requests, right. all this stuff. But I realized that like, it's tough. It only, yeah, it's tough. And it like my, it shows only if I'm doing a song that I really right. want to sing, you know? Right. And also yeah. the genre that you want to exactly. sing it in and also the range of your voice. You have to consider all that as well. Our next caller this afternoon is Cedric. Hello, Cedric. Hi. Yes. Um, I have a question for Jen today. Yeah. Um, do you write any original songs? Have you ever tried? Um, who are you talking about this? <laughs> <laughs> um, well, there's so, there's been so many times where I've tried um, and just never finished. But I actually sat down yesterday on the keyboard and. Yeah, it's beautiful. I, I got, <laughs> it helps beautiful. when you're inspired. Yes. When are we gonna see it on YouTube, or is um, it up yet? Oh, not yet. Um, hopefully within this month. I hope. Yeah, yeah. Tonight? Yeah. Not, not tonight. Not tonight. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Stephanie, our third caller. Hello. Hi. Yes. Um, yeah, I heard that Jenny, you said that you actually used to audition for Korean Entertainment, and actually, I was planning on auditioning for one next month. I was wondering if you had any like advice or tips that you could give me. That's a good question. Advice or tips when you audition? Um, it really depends on the entertainment company. But um, just overall, um, just be confident. Really just be confident. And um, don't, don't, look, don't be shy. That's really the number one thing. Because if they see that you're shy, then they'll think that when you're performing out there, when you eventually become somebody, mm -hmm. when you're performing out there, then th there's just like, and, and also I don't know how to explain it. When you're shy, doesn't it show also in the voice, like your voice exactly. is not as full? Yeah. But um, we'll take more of your phone calls. That's the number on the screen. Our phone lines are open today, and you get to talk to them, and hopefully AJ Raphael as well. When we return, you still haven't answered the question, 
Later, we'll do that bad comments. How does it affect you? We'll return on the show. Don't go away. <laughs>